The last program on this series of the Windows C experience is a game, one that I actually have been playing a lot. It's called X Word C, and once you open it, you get a list of options, right? Um, and uh, once you load one of them, let me do this again because I just I tapped it by accident. So let's see, you go for like medium 11 by 11, right? And then you get a chance to across or down. So what do you have to do? Yes, yeah, so let's see. Across would be big. And Fleming would probably be E on Fleming. And that's how you go, yeah? Once you're done with your puzzle, then you come to Cheats and you can show right so you get the answer if you don't know or you can check so let's see how this would work so let's go here large big i can do cheats check across and check down right or i can check the grid but the grid is not good i still have 93 blocks to go in the final menu you can save your puzzle, so where you are, you can delete the save file if you want to restart it, or you can open a new puzzle. When you open a new puzzle, get a list of all the available puzzles, just as you saw before. In view, you can read all the screen, I don't know why, probably because of a bug or some issue. Uh, you can clear the puzzle and start again. So let's go for big and yeah. Un. I can't delete, but I can clear with space. When you go typing, you can choose not to type, or if you're typing across or down. Right. In sheets, then you can, as I mentioned before, show something specific. So, for example, if I go to show letter, it's the same as the, the question mark. You see, I now for me art sound is a ba and concerning is an anent and a cashier. I can go to cheats and show down clue and treasurer. And you feel the word and then if I go to cheats and show across a, a near is a unit of corn whatever right you can swap here to be typing oh, this already this can be typed horizontally or vertically right and in help there's no help file available. Also, well, happens. You can register it, but it's already registered. I think now it's available as a freeware. Um, about this puzzle, you can see who created the puzzle, the size of it. And if there is a theme, the theme would go here. And X Word C was developed by Emerald Technology in Florida. I need to check later if the web page still exists. And the last thing here, and the last item in this whole series, if we go to help or to cheats and show grid, it's gonna scream that you're cheating, you tap yes, and you get the whole answer. So this is a fun game for a trip. You can play with your friend in a train or in a plane and he doesn't check nothing on the internet. It's great. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.